My name is Marsha Izumi. I'm from Pasadena, California. Hola, soy Anton Castellano Susigli, uh, originalmente México. Robert A. Marchman from Maplewood, New Jersey. Palm Desert, California. Baltimore, Maryland. Berkeley, California. They come to PFLAG in crisis. Their life is falling apart because their child is coming out. I initially got involved in PFLAG because my son was withdrawn, depressed, and suicidal, and I didn't know where to turn. She comes home and says, Mom, I'm transgender. And I said, okay, are you sure? I said, I said, you know, we're going to move forward. How hard it must have been to navigate a gender journey with a teenager. Well, Mom, it may not be a big deal to you, but it's a big deal to me. And that was one of those moments that I will never forget. I was aware of the painful experience of many LGBTQ people of color. Um, and that was something that um, was frankly painful for me. We had to reconcile having our new normal, which was our gay son, with what anti-gay messages were coming out of the Southern Baptist Convention at that time. My child was the first one to transition in our public schools and she was pretty badly bullied. So having some friends in the PFLAG community really meant the world to my family. La primera vez que escuché de PFLAG fue a través de un mentor en la Ciudad de México que me enseñó el poder que los papás de personas LGBTQ pueden tener como activistas por la igualdad y por los derechos humanos. PFLAG um, is on a journey of not only educating itself, but educating others so that we can be in a place where we can gain equality for the entire LGBT community. As an educational resource, uh, PFLAG is the only thing that's out there for families like mine. I want to bring um, the message to communities of color and uh, black and brown communities that this is an organization, that PFLAG is an organization that um, can support the community. All the people that spend all the time and all the hours learning, training, sharing, telling their stories, like literally without the human connection, none of this would be possible and none of this would work. We all seek to belong to something that is greater than ourselves. And, and, and PFLAG has given me that opportunity. By being out and proud and an advocate, I could actually be potentially a role model or a sounding board or, um, or somehow just make some kid's life a little bit easier. As a PFLAG dad, proud PFLAG dad, to be an advocate for my son who I love dearly um, is something that's very special and uh, important to me. It's the screen test for anybody who's dating, anybody in our family. It's like, you can't be a part of our family unless you pass the PFLAG test. <laughs> PFLAG made it possible for my family to stay together. So no matter what other people say, no matter what you may hear from those other people and other places that say something different, don't even give them a second thought because we love you just as you are. Baby, you, my child, I love you and you are walking in those shoes. I'm just here to love and support you and this is how we will move forward, so.